need advice. How do I consistently draw barns? Uh, put two copies in your deck. Better yet, if you have the spare dust, put in three. I mean, eventually you hit, like, critical mass of barns, though, where you start barnsing into barns. And that's just not really what where you want to be. Watch this! I'm gonna keep the four attack guys because it's priest. We have turned our curse into our strength. Yeah, I'm a huge fan of uh Wrath Guards in, in Even Warlock. I think it is crazy how long people weren't playing this card. Um I mean, it's going to be tough to beat Big Priest because the deck does well against us, but if there's ever a hand to do it, I think this is it. Wrathguard isn't dangerous? No, you want to be lowering your life total um, in this deck. That's part of the point. Especially in the wild version where you have Molten Giants, so it just actually you know, is to your benefit. Yeah, Wrathguard and your Spellstone. This is actually uh, exactly one card off of the, the list that I typically run. Which is why I liked it so much, because it's it's basically just the same deck as mine. Uh, I just I usually run Zehi or an 8-drop instead of the uh, um, instead of the Spellbreaker. But Spellbreakers are definitely still good. I'm gonna tap. Play this for 3 mana. Force him to respond. If he doesn't, we get another 8-8. Eight, eight. When I use Wrathguard, my opponents always have Shield Slam to 700 damage. I've Shield Slammed a Wrathguard once, and it does feel very good. But, like, you just lose to Odd Warrior anyway, so... Might as well get it out of the way early. Careful of Light Bomb? Yeah, I think I'm going in with a uh, Twilight Drake instead of the... Instead of the Shambler. For that very reason. And that's why we held on to these. And so we're just... Gonna take it a little bit slower. Is that Wall Priest any good? Um, I don't know. I was just seeing that on HS Replay today. I don't really know. What to think of it. That's a bummer. I really wanted a uh, Spellbreaker here. Hit this, please. It's probably the second best target. It's fine. We've still got 18 showing. Probably needs to... You can't, like, remove everything and develop on the same turn. So hopefully no resurrect. Uh... Tap for Spellbreaker. Dark Bomb change anything? Probably not. Okay, we still get the attacks. Man. He's just wrecking our big boys. Maybe I should have held that back into his uh, Psychic Scream turn, but... That's not Psychic Scream. Order? Yeah, I should have played the, the Homunculus. Um, we're almost there. Even if he reses. Okay. Do I want to tap here? Six, two, tap. Or I could go four, four. I want to tap because that gives me a chance to draw the second dark bomb, which is not necessarily guaranteed. Um, yeah, let's tap. It's me closer to Spellbreaker in case he resurrects another. Like, Resurrect Heal is my nightmare. That's still fine. We win.
Oof. Oof. Yeah, it does feel good to win those. So yeah, I agree completely. And yeah, we'll give this deck one more game and then we'll we'll start losing again. Because if there's one thing I know about Twitch chat, it's they love watching the streamer lose. We have turned our curse when they don't have death or AOE, yeah, exactly. But the, the problem is that they have so much uh, removal and AOE. That usually you can't really uh, expect them uh, not to have it. This should be a good matchup though, because like, how does a warlock deal with our stuff? I want the turn three giant, so I'm gonna tap. Lose more, please. Don't worry, we'll get there. We'll get there. The end is coming. Well, that's rude. I think the coin is more valuable. So he's Reno Lock, or Treachery, or Mechathun. Or even Cube. He could be Cube. He's Reno Lock. Didn't need that anyway. Why aren't you using Zihi or Rag? Uh, this isn't my deck. It's a. It's a viewer submission. Usually I run either one of those two cards in this in the spellbreaker spot. But I am not today. So we probably want to remove that and play a Wrath Guard. That leaves us a bit weak to Hellfire, so I'm actually going to play this and uh Dark Bomb. But I think that there's like the it, the double shadow flame may not be as necessary with fewer even shamans around. Uh, so I think that there's like three flex spots in this deck. It's like the double shadow flame that I have going right now. Played around that, by the way, and it's the uh, the spell breaker. Depends on what you're facing as to which is optimal. This is going to be good in this matchup though, because like the opponent is likely going to get a void. Lord at some point, and we can just deal with that. We also just have lethal set up. I don't like Shadow Flame at all, actually. I liked it in the previous meta. I think it was at least a one of, just because Molten Hellfire or Molten Shadow Flame against a lot of decks just wins. Can't play that yet. I don't really want to use this, so I'm just going to hang on to it. I also don't want to commit any damage because um, he could have Reno. Hellfire tap giant. I don't want to commit the uh, the homunculus because this is going into his twisting another turn. Okay. It's lethal. Have I tried to auto chess? Not yet. Uh, I probably will at some point. Is this just regular even lock? Yeah, but it was a it was a viewer request. And as a sellout streamer, when somebody gives me bits, along with the deck code, you know, I'm inclined to play it. Like I said, though, we'll go back to the um, to the Yogg deck shortly. Thanks for making Hearthstone so fun. I get too much ladder anxiety and tilt, and you show that how fun it can be to lose even. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, if you go in with the right mindset, to, especially when we were playing that deck... Like, I had no expectation of winning those games, so it was easy to just, like, let it slide off. So I'm thinking we're dead. 
Unless this mountain giant sticks. Noggin Fogger is more fun than winning? Yeah, it can be. I mean, there are times where, like last month, um, I was certainly a wreck trying to, uh, trying to climb ranks. So there, I mean, there are definitely times where it's not easy to lose. But for the most part, I mean, it's a, it's a children's card game. Okay, so he's stopping to think for a bit. Oh no. Oh no, this is not going to go well for him. If I don't kill this, uh, f seven, eight, nine, we probably lose to Sap. So I just set up for the lethal next turn. Prep Sap is, or prep Myra's into Sap is sad face. Okay. This is none of those things. And now he's dead. Blood and, blood. and now he's still dead. Yeah, I don't... I don't think he wanted to hit me down to 10 there. Thank you.